What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Jazz Marie, a.k.a. She Have It All. And I am back again with another mukbang, y'all. Yes, this is actually going to be a quick one because I didn't realize that uh, my mom was having company. So, since she's having company, I'm going to have to hold, go ahead and speed through this. Um, this is actually homemade. I made me a homemade burger, which I haven't had in a long time. It's just a cheeseburger, mayonnaise on potato bread. And I actually made me a homemade salad. Nothing too fancy, just um, romaine, lettuce, uh, cheese, bacon, and my egg is still boiling. But like I said, I didn't know my time was dwindling. Okay, so I'm going to say grace and we're going to get it in. I don't have my plaque, so I'm just going to go traditional. Amen. Okay, y'all. So actually, today is not even just me wanting to eat. I actually just wanted to talk to you guys just a little bit because I've been feeling stressed. I don't know if anybody else has been feeling stressed, but every time around this this time of year, I get real stressed because I just be thinking about um, Christmas, you know, Christmas and then um, the kids' birthdays is in January. Everything kind of just comes to a head at this time. So you like, I get like extremely stressed out. Um, yeah, and it's just ridiculous. So I just wanted to talk about the real, the, the, the real that nobody really wants to kind of be honest about. Hold on, because I don't know why this is in my video. We ain't doing it. Actually, that's a little bit better. Okay, and then I have my water too. Just get a liter there. Okay. So I'm gonna at least try to get a bite of my burger real quick before. I'm just gonna put some ketchup on it, y'all. Nothing major, nothing special. Nothing special. Morgan, can you give me a minute so I can finish this video real quick, please, sweetheart? Huh? Huh? I said just give me a minute, okay? I'm about to be done in a minute. Okay. Okay, y'all. See, like I said, I didn't know. I don't want to be in nobody's way, so. I'll make it quick, but I ain't have a homemade burger in forever. So, mm. that's good. When I originally went to my to the kitchen today, I'm like, I need to go to the market. There ain't nothing here to eat, but actually. Just gotta look a little bit deeper sometimes, you know. By the end of the month, beginning of the month, it's always time to go back to the market and restock. So I said, wait a minute, let me take a different look. And let me see what I can do. So I had like a little half a piece of ground beef left over from this weekend. I had some lettuce. So you, basically you say. So I just basically used what I had to come up with this meal. Um, I keep looking back because I see the, camera, my, the front door cam. Just in case the family, the, his family, about to come in. Mm. All right. So, so, I want to get to point before we lose track of time and everything. But I'm gonna try to stop looking back. I wanted to eat this with y'all, man. I don't know. All right, well, let's just get into it. Um, I want to talk about the real. I'm going to be real with you guys. I'm stressed. I am not rich. I'm not rich by far. Like, I am still struggling out here in this world. I don't even give a damn. I'm just saying. Because people want to all act like it's glitz and glam. And maybe for, for them it is. I'm not going to hold you. Like, maybe for, for them it is. You have no struggles, no stress. That's great. We all trying to get like you. <laughs> but then there's the people down here. On the ground, hey us, <laughs> working hard to, you know, make our kids happy, make ends meet, look up to par, do all these things that society says that we're supposed to do, um, and it's hard trying to catch catch up, okay? Like, every year, I, I definitely want to bring it for my daughter uh, for Christmas every time. I don't want her to be disappointed ever. Um, now I have a Myers. I don't want him to be disappointed ever. You always want to make their Christmas magical. My mom always made our Christmas magical um, every morning we got up. So I just kind of want to keep that same tradition. Uh, but I had no idea how hard it was to try to do that same specific thing. So 
Yes, and because we have Christmas, and then right after Farrah's birthday is on the 14th of January, and Amaya's is on the 25th of January, I have to figure out how I'm going to do things differently because I'm not about to set myself up to be super stressed out or going crazy or doing something that I won't normally do. Um, so, yeah, I just wanted to talk to you. I don't know if any of you guys are feeling that, like that. Comment below. Let me know that I am not alone out here in this world, y'all, because mama is stressed. So, mama is stressed. So I just basically wanted to, um, shut. I decided the other day to basically just, uh, start writing. I don't have my journal yet, but I had some stuff on my mind. So, I just wanted to, like, jot some stuff down. <laughs> and, I don't know, I, I might make this, like, a thing. Because it was therapeutic getting it off my chest and everything like that. Um, let me try to bite my burger again. Yeah. It was therapeutic. And funny, because I'm over here laughing at myself. But... I don't know. It's like my thoughts mixed with poetry, mixed with... I don't even know. I'm just talking. So I'm just going to share it with you guys. I mean... <laughs> that's it. So the title of it is called Broke Ass Christmas. <laughs> that's the title of this journal entry. It's called Broke Ass Christmas. Okay. Here we are. Another broke ass year. Let's define broke for the ones in the back. Broke as in just having enough, enough for bills, essentials, and allowance. Not a dime in my savings and, and only change in the bottom of my purse. But watch this. Somehow, someway, I'm a goddamn magi magician. Because I still bring the magic every year. <laughs> and that's it. That's it. Short and sweet. It's like... So now if I have something that I want to say, just no matter how simple it is or whatever, I'm just going to say it. I'm going to write it down. I'm going to get it off my chest. I'm going to just let it be. I'm going to let it. I'm going to let it off my chest because it's actually much better that way. And yeah, I realize I'm talking to myself in this journal, but it appeased me. I literally just got the book and started writing. Um, so I just want to say to all the mommies out there who is breaking bank and back to try to make things happen. I pray for you this year. Um, I told Farrah, because you know Farrah's old enough now. I don't know who's the listener. Farrah's old enough to know the real about Santa. And um, she can understand. We have so we had so much loss this year in our family. Uh, we had so much loss, period, in the world. Um, jobs was lost. Uh, I moved back in with my mom because of the job loss. Um, new situations occurred with Amaya's. Or, you know, just hearing things happen. Um, and this has been like, you know, one of the toughest years, I think, you know, for all of us for, to say the least. So it's a struggle. It is okay. I am here to tell you it is okay. If you do not have it, it is okay. If you can only buy those one or two gifts, it is okay for you to say no. It is okay for you not to want to go. It's okay for you to say you're not going to go pick somebody up because you don't feel like it. It is okay. So I've decided that, of course, Christmas is always a time for giving. Giving, giving, giving. And I'm going to give myself this year some peace of mind. I'm going to give myself some peace of mind to not stress, to try to go with the flow. Of course, do what I need to do. But not stressing myself out about it, not breaking down about it, not crying about it. Just going to enjoy my broke-ass Christmas <laughs> and call it a day. Now, as y'all know, I'm doing Vlogmas. Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel because I'm definitely coming back with the mukbangs. And subscribe to my um, my vlogging channel, She Have It All TV. I just started Vlogmas over there and I actually, I actually uploaded a video today so you guys should go check that out. Um, we celebrated Sideline Mom's birthday this weekend. Um, her birthday was actually yesterday on the 4th, so we had a good time for that. Um, so just make sure you guys check out Vlogmas. Um, yeah, I'm trying to make the videos good and great, but sometimes you're going to see the real, which is just us in the house doing house things. Like, I love to watch Christmas movies, to decorate, 
and things like that. So, like I said, I am not rich. And I won't be breaking bank for nobody. So I'm about to wrap this up. Like I told y'all, it's going to be a quick one. Because my mom is expecting company. But I just wanted to share that with you guys. And be honest. Be honest. Okay? Don't be lying. You're only lying to yourself. Like, yep. Some people have money. I ain't one of those people. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, y'all. I'm not, you know, there's people in worse situations, and I pray for them too as well. But right now, I'm talking about my situation. So I'm just going to pray for me to get through these holidays and do what I need to do. That's at least shot. This, uh, I don't even want to mess this up unless I'm going to be able to, like, really finish it. Look how pretty it is. We not got a glass bowl. I'm going to just save that for later. I'm going to just finish the burger with you guys because, like I said, I didn't know. It was things going on here today, so I want to be out of the way. And I got to clean up my little setup as well, so. Burger is actually good. I seasoned it well, cooked it well. I did good. I wanted to say so much more, but. Ubusa. And then, right when you feel like you have it all figured out, like, okay. I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that, I'm going to get this money, I'm going to do this, and I'm going to do that. But things always happen where things always come up where you, that you have to take into consideration. You got to expect the unexpected. That's what you got to do. Expect the unexpected. I don't know if I was sure. My mom had got this made for me for my birthday. That just passed. <clears throat> Dang, I'm kind of full off of that burger anyway. I don't even know if I was able to eat that solid. I don't know who don't drink water, but y'all missing out. There ain't nothing more satisfying. Comment down below if I'm doing horrible with these mukbangs. Mukbangs. I'm not barely eating all my meals, y'all. But actually, that's really actually good for me. I changed my way of eating, so I don't eat as much. I get full faster. So, you yeah, know, that's good, actually. Y'all know I'm trying to lose the gut. One day. Mm. 
Kom. Hi, y'all. Well, thank you so much for listening to my rant. <laughs> if that was even a rant. Uh, make sure you subscribe to this channel. If you have not already, make sure you like this video. Hmm. I'm full. I'm probably about to go take a nap. Which is not good. <laughs> Alright, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time. Peace.